Hey, Princeton K. Okay, I am here to read you a story this morning. I'm very excited because this is actually a book that I used to be read to when I was a little girl. When I was your age, my parents read this story to me when I was in bed and I would be all snuggled up ready to go to sleep. So I'm very excited to read this story to you today. So this story is called It's Not Easy Being a Bunny. I thought this was appropriate for after... Um, Easter Sunday. So here we go. This story is written by Marilyn Sadler. So that means she is the what? If it's written by her, that means she is the author. And it's illustrated by Roger Bolin. That means he did what? He drew the pictures. Yeah, great job. Okay, here we go. PJ Funny Bunny was very sad. He did not like being a bunny. His mother made him eat cooked carrots every day. He had far too many brothers and sisters, and his ears were very One day, PJ decided to leave home. I don't want to be a bunny anymore, said PJ. I want to be a... No, let's see what he wants to be. A bear! And PJ went to live with the bears. When the bears went to sleep for the winter, PJ could not sleep at all. Living with the bears was not very exciting. So PJ said, I don't want to be a bear. I want to be a, I don't know. Let's find out. A bird! And PJ went to live with the birds. PJ liked being a bird until he tried to fly. So PJ said, I don't want to be a bear or a bird. I want to be a... I don't know. A beaver! And PJ went to live with the beavers. The beavers liked to work very hard. PJ did not like to work at all. So PJ said, I don't want to be a bear or a bird or a beaver. I want to be a... I don't know. A pig! And PJ went to live with the pigs. Only thing the pigs liked to do was sit in the mud. So PJ said, I don't want to be a bear or a bird or a beaver or a pig. I want to be a... I don't know. A moose! And PJ went to live with the moose. Mook! But PJ could not make good moose calls. So PJ said, I don't want to be a bear or a bird or a beaver or a pig or a moose. I want to be a... Possum! And PJ went to live with the possums. Possums like to hang upside down, but hanging upside down gave PJ a headache. 
So PJ said, I don't want to be a bear or a bird or a beaver or a pig or a moose or a possum. I want to be a... Skunk! And PJ went to live with the skunks. Do you want to be a skunk, Prince Mickey? It did not take PJ very long to find out that he did not like living with the skunks. So PJ said, I don't want to be a bear or a bird or a beaver or a pig or a moose or a possum or most of all, a skunk. What I really want to be is a Do you really think he wants to be Prince Mickey? A bunny. So PJ hurried home. The funny bunnies were very happy to see him. PJ was very happy to see them. That night, PJ ate all of his cooked carrots and played with every one of his brothers and sisters. He was so happy to be a bunny again that he did not care that his ears were very big. At least everyone can see that I am a bunny, PJ said, and not a... bear or a bird or a beaver or pig or moose or possum or a skunk. The end. So that was It's Not Easy Being a Bunny. And in the end, Mr. PJ Funny Bunny he was trying so hard to be somebody else that he wasn't. And it's important, Princeton K, my little sweet kiddos, that you know that you are exactly who you are supposed to be. And Mrs. Gloria and I love you exactly as you are. So don't try to be something that you are not and know that you are loved exactly as you are by your mom, your dad, your grandma, your grandpa, Everybody in your family loves you so much, and so do I, Mrs. Glory. We miss you so much, and I hope you enjoyed that story, and I will see you all later. Bye, Princeton Kate.